This is a teardown of a Netgear ProSafe VPN firewall, model FVS318. And this has eight ports on it, plus an internet connectivity port. Seems to be of decent construction. Although I will admit, personally, I'm not a big fan of Netgear stuff. Although I'm spoiled considering I get all sorts of commercial grade hardware through work. Alright, let's see if this wants to slide off nicely or violently. <laughs> Oh geez, there's basically nothing in there. <laughs> they spent more money on the uh, the steel housing than the motherboard, it seems like. Although admittedly, uh, I'm sure the chips probably cost a lot more than the metal housing. But I'm uh, a bit surprised how large this is, despite what's internal. Like they would have had enough space to mount a built-in power supply in there if they wanted to. A little rust or corrosion on the board. I feel like this can be a pretty quick teardown compared to my normal ones. It's really not much to see. You've already seen most of it. <laughs> hmm. You know what happened there? It's not, not rust. Um, I think something was spilled on it. But here's the PCB. Looks like we got some real tech chips here. Oh, upside down. And uh, maybe some power regulation stuff going on here. That's probably the flash for the boot. But can't tell what it is. Like they tried to. Code it with something to stop you from reading it. And just a memory chip. So, yeah. <laughs> Maybe a record for my teardowns. Usually they take a while. Um, but not much to see on this. Weird that they chose to put the power supply outside. Maybe it's easier to do that though. I don't know. Nice little through hole switch there. I don't really salvage or save that kind of stuff. I get so much of it, it just doesn't matter. But, uh, yeah, either way, hopefully that was interesting, and thanks for watching.